Are you looking to add movie clips to your edits on CapCut on your Mac and PC? Yes, you are. In this video, I'm going to teach you how to find and add movie clips to your edits. Let's get started. But first of all, let's address whether or not we're actually allowed to use movie clips in our edits. And from my research, it seems like the answer isn't clear cut. It depends on the nature of your video. It depends on how much footage you use. Did you alter the footage in any way? And I'm not an expert. I'm not a lawyer. So what I've done is I've linked a whole bunch of resources in the description down below so you could have a better idea of whether or not you're actually allowed to. So in summary, I recommend doing your own research and using other people's footage always carries some sort of risk. So make sure you understand and be aware of all of those things. But if you were to use movie clips in your edits, I'm just going to show you how I would do it. So what I would do is I would go to Chrome and search up Get yarn. So this website is what I would use. And let's say we want to search for a movie quote. We can either search for the quote or the TV show. I usually search for the quote. For example, I've been watching a lot of suits lately. Let's search for lives like this. I like this. There we go, life's like this, I like this. See if there are any other ones. We'll just select this. Life's like this, but I like this. <laughs> so what I can do is I can go uh, search clips of this show. And I can look at all the clips from this show. I just opened it in a new tab. So... Yeah, these are all the quotes we can use. But let's go back and let's say we want to download this one. What I would do is I'd right click here, save video as lives like this. Now just save under downloads for the sake of this tutorial. And then I'll open CapCut and say this is the video I want to add it to. This is actually a split screen video. If you want to learn how you can make videos like this, check out the tutorial here but let's just import the clip there we go lives like this drag it to our timeline let's say we want it in between these two clips like that there we go we just piece it together and let's say we want it bigger so we just select it adjust the scale and there you go. It's magic. Life's like this, but I like this. <laughs> and that's how you can add movie clips to your edits. Thanks for watching. My name is Junius. I'm a medical student, but on the side, I document whatever I learn in regards to content, especially educational content on this channel. Thanks for watching. I organize everything on my channel into playlists. And if that sounds interesting to you, consider subscribing. See you in the next one.